All right, here we are inside of Premiere Pro and we have all these videos that I downloaded. The videos include people dancing and we'll try to match all these videos into our music that we have here. So we can select the music and drag this to our sequence, to our audio track one. And then we can select it, press G so that we can set the gain. We'll type in minus 15, should be not, so that we reduce the volume of the music. Click OK and then we can double click on this audio track one if you want to see more of this beats. You can double click on it again if you want to see less. Or if you go to this lines, we can move this to how much we want. But I rather double click. I'll double click on this again because I want to see this beats. So now we want to see how to add markers. So if I move a little forward and then press M, you can see that it places this yellowish sign called marker. So for example, if I drop a video here, another way to add a marker is if we select the video, we can press M and then it adds a marker to the video. And if we don't have anything selected and then we press M, it adds a marker to the sequence. And that's how we'll do it for this time. I'll press Ctrl Z to undo all of this and then we'll play this through and then each time there is a beat I'll press M. So I'll click here and then make sure that I don't have anything selected. I'll place one here to the beginning because it will need to add a video here. We'll play this through and each time there is a beat I'll press M. M M M M M M M M and so on that's how it goes so I'll move a little forward and then press W so that it cuts the rest of the parts. So we'll select, we'll go to the beginning here and then select all these videos that we have. So select the first one, shift select the last one and I'll press Ctrl and deselect this one. Click on this so that it deselects. That's our sequence. So what we can do now is while having all of this selected, we can go down here to automate to sequence. Click on this and then we can adjust some settings here. So you want to change this to selecting order and change this placement to add unnumbered markers. Selection order so that it sets the cuts in order. Or if you want to place it yourself, you can click on this one, sort order. We'll click OK. We don't have to select anything else. We can click OK. And here we have all the cuts that we need according to the rhythm of the music. That's why we placed all these markers. So we can now take a look at it. And that's how it goes. It messed up here in the middle because we lack videos, more videos. We only had 12 videos. If we had more, we could keep on going even more. So that's how you match videos to your rhythm of the music. Thanks for watching guys. I'll see you on the next video.